Hi guys and welcome to another Derelict in the UK video. Today we are in Langley, Sussex, exploring these two wonderful cottages. You hear the sarcasm in my voice? They're not that great. There's a few nice bits in there, but hey. Anyway, we also have a Q&A video coming up, so remember, if you have any questions, please leave them in the comments below and we'll answer them in our video and we'll give you a shout out as well. Uh, also, we've got uh, loads of amazing new stuff coming up. We're going to try 24 hour challenges. Uh, we're going to try, uh, we've got a drone for some aerial footage as well. Uh, we've got loads of other stuff coming, so hit subscribe. And if you like the video, hit the like button, leave a comment. Remember, questions in the comments. We'll answer every question asked, serious, funny, whatever. We'll answer them all. Anyway, let's get exploring this building. Okay, there you go. So both the houses are actually joining together. I thought they were separate, but they're not. Jittery, it is about one degrees outside, um, and obviously, there's no heating in here, so it's not far above that inside. It's pretty cool. Who does that? 
really. Beautiful day outside, but like I say, it is freezing cold. So I apologise if it's a bit jittery. Another cracking bit of graffiti there. Let's have a bath in it. Seems that the upstairs aren't connected together, but the downstairs is. Probably identical to the other side, it normally is. What is it with penises? Jesus. Oh, bathroom's almost, almost identical. Same colour. is a beautiful side cabinet. What is it doing in an abandoned building? Another penis there on this. Anyway, let's get out of here. Toilet roll in there as well. This was a caravan, and um, you can see a bat inside there. Bit trash now though. <clears throat> There's a shed down here as well. I'm not gonna bother going in there. The land that these houses on is absolutely humongous. There's even a lake or a large pond. 
I'll show you it in a minute. actually hear ducks in the water right now. There's a boat. I'm not going to bother going any further but it does go quite a bit further back. may recognise this place from a previous Facebook post I did a while back. Unfortunately at the time the place was very well sealed and we couldn't get in. I popped back today as I was in the area and luckily enough the local youths have been and smashed the place up a bit more so now there's the access. Here's the lake. 